Hey there. Have you set up your Instamojo online store? Wondering what the next steps should be? Simple. It's now time to customize and organize your store so that visitors can navigate through your website easily. In this video, we'll show you how to add pages and menus to your Instamojo online store. Adding these features would allow you to give your customers a greater shopping experience. Here are some reasons why customizing your store is important. Your website is a virtual version of a brick and mortar store. Consider the pages to be shelves of various products which will help your customers find what they're looking for easily. Use each page of your website to provide valuable information to the visitor. Most important pages that you need on your website are the home page, about us page, various product catalog pages, etc. Towards the end of the video, I'll also show you a few websites which make the best use of these pages. Let's get right into it. Step 1. You'll first need to log in to your Instamojo account to access your dashboard. Once you're in, you'll find the pages and the menu option listed under the online store section within the store setup options. You simply click on it and you'll be taken to this page here. You'll be able to see a list of all the pages that have been created on your website so far. Since we haven't created any new pages, you will just see the default ones here, which we spoke about earlier. About us, contact us, FAQs, etc. Let's just go ahead and create a new page. Click on create new page over here. Once you do, you'll see this page where you will need to choose a name for your page. Let's call it water bottles for now. You also have an option to add external links to your store as pages. You can use this in case you'd want to redirect people to another website. Next up, you'll need to frame the link to the page that you're creating. We need to make sure that we're following the format mentioned below. As this page is called water bottles, we'll be entering that text with leading and trailing slashes like this as this will be a part of the website address. Now we'll need to assign a title to the page. This will be visible to all your visitors and customers. The title cannot be less than three characters. Let's continue and name it Bottles. Next up, you'll have the option to add a description to the page here. You can use various formatting options available to you to customize the text. You can bold it, italicize it, change the font, add images, embed a video, etc. You can also choose to display the page on your header and footer of the website. The header is basically the text that shows up on top of the page which is consistent across all pages and so is the case with the footer. It just appears at the bottom. And we're done! All we need to do now is press on the create page button. As you can see, the page has been created and added to the list of the pages at the bottom here. It's been set to off by default. To view the page created, you simply have to toggle this button on and click on the small icon over here. It will redirect you to your page on the website. As promised, here are some great examples of websites that make the best use of pages and menus. Click on the link in the description below to create your fully customized online store with Instamojo today.